hey you guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl ebony all right you guys this will be a black tea blog short and we do have two topics to discuss in this video now the first topic is none other than jada pinkett smith responding to chris rock throwing major shade during his netflix special and she is calling chris rock super obsessed now you guys know the whole situation between chris rock and the smith family has been a mess to say the least you guys remember that a couple of months ago will smith did get on stage at the oscars to slap the taste out of chris rock's mouth after he made a ball-headed joke about Jada. Now after that happened, Chris Rock was pretty much silent about the whole thing. Well, over the weekend, he did release his Netflix special and Chris Rock had a lot to say about Will Smith and Jada. Check this out. Have any entanglements? She hurt him way more than he hurt me. Everybody call him a <laughs> Now, talk about a mess. This is a whole hot mess. Now, sources close to Jada are actually releasing a statement. And in my opinion, I really do think she should let Will and his team handle this. But you guys know Jada is always trying to be above the curve if there is some controversy. Now, Jada's team is saying this. Look at where Chris Rock chose to film his special in Baltimore, which is Jada's hometown. It was also brought up that Jada was really upset at the fact that Chris Rock continued to call her the B word, like over and over call her the B word. And she feels that he's disrespectful, not only that, but that he is truly obsessed with her. Now look you guys, Chris Rock has been very quiet. Did I think he was gonna go in like this about Will Smith? I actually did anticipate this because he was humiliated. So it's almost like this was his chance to really let off everything in his chest. Now, do I think that he's obsessed with Jada? In my personal opinion, I do a little bit. Chris Rock has been joking about Jada for years. I mean, for years and years and years. And some of the jokes really don't even make any sense. But look, you guys, this is a sticky situation. People are actually saying that Chris Rock needs to be slapped again, allegedly. All right, you guys, let's go to the final topic, which is none other than Lotto and her new song, Lottery, bankrupt and falling off the charts. Talk about a mess. And when I say bankrupt, oh, I don't mean seriously like tanking. I mean plummeting, okay? Free falling, okay? Sinking, all right? Tanked. Wow. Now look, you guys, Lotto did all that mouth talking, all that stuff, talking about that she is that girl that, you know, everybody is just so mad because she's winning, etc. But she released Lottery and people thought that this would be another song that she could actually have on the charts. Now her song debuted at number and it's only was on there for about a week, okay? Now after this week, her song is nowhere to be found on the Hot 100. Talk about a mess, Lotto. See, this is what happens when you disrespect legends in the game. Lotto has to understand that it's a certain formula to releasing music and also the Billboard Hot 100. She already had Big Energy. The reason Big Energy did so well, in my opinion, is because she added Mariah Carey. Now the song did have some traction before then, right? But it was something different. It was a breath of fresh air. This whole song, Lottery, sounds like everything else we've already seen. It sounds like Sweetie Closer. It sounds a lot like Say So. And I mean, it just really sounds like her previous work. People don't know who Lotto is. They don't know if they should support her as a rapper rapper, as a pop rapper. Like she just doesn't have a niche that she's solidified in. So people don't understand and they don't support that. And also on top of that, a lot of people feel like Lotto was fake, allegedly. So look you guys, looks like Lotto needs to go back to the drawing board and try her best to find a hit, all right? Stop recording people and find that hit, sis. All right, you guys, let me know what you think about this down below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Give this video a big thumbs up. I love you guys so much. Bye, guys.